the biggest joke. Look what I found in the river yesterday. And it's not the first time. They have to be more careful. That's it. Plastic is very bad for the rivers. It can't be possible that they're getting the water dirty. Let's go and teach the babies of the valley a lesson. Um, let's paint the water with colors. Aren't we overdoing this? It's just for a little bit. Let's go up and look at their faces through the spyglass. Okay, but a quick joke. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> Turn. Ready for my new invention? The flying stone. Careful! <laughs> no! What did you do, Missy? Nothing. Then why is the water violet? And the house's bubbles are violet. Let's go and see a pacifier fountain. Hashtag violet. Hashtag water. <laughs> Water that tastes like ice cream? Something is wrong with our world. We had to ask for help from the fantasy. Winged heart. I want to go to the other side. A, a little, little step here, here, a little step there, and, and the fantasy, fantasy portal will reveal itself. itself. Where is everybody? <laughs> Let me see. There is Lala. <laughs> Poor Katie. And look, her face is clueless. <laughs> I love the joke of coloring huh? the water. Mm. The fantasies did it. They colored the water. And they're looking at us through the spying glass. Laughing at us. Very lucky. Making fun of us. We'll do the same. Hello. Connie's making little cakes. Come to the valley. I want some. Hey. Save one for me. I can't fly. Where are you going? Cupcakes at Connie's house. Now it's our turn to look. Let's see who had the last laugh. Yeah! Whoa! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they just fell on the first one. Let's see. I'm sure she's telling. Uh. Orange is my favorite. It goes with the color of my eye. <laughs> <laughs> they fell on the second trap. Of course. Although I prefer to look like a wild berry. Uh, they caught us. Look, that's enough. You have stained us with color. You have color or water. It's just a joke. The color will go away. It was just to teach you a lesson. The other day we found a plastic bottle in the river and that's not right. Our water is important to our world. It needs extra care. This is a responsibility we all share. Well, it was a horrible joke. And we didn't toss that bottle. Well, someone tossed it. Ugh, the bottle again? We said no. I said yes. yes. That's my bottle. Thanks for finding it. The wind blew it away the other day. By the way, what are you celebrating? What are we celebrating? Oh! The day of the colors. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, sorry. To be honest, we overdid it a little bit. But in the end, the joke was a funny hit. <laughs> Oh, <laughs>
keep an eye open. We don't want the same thing to happen like last night. Oh, not again! <gasps> Cutie, protect me! Huh? <sighs> Help! Oh, what's happening, Connie? There's a monster under my bed! Seriously! Come on, Connie, it's always the same. Okay, whose turn is it? I stayed yesterday. It's Missy's turn. I have a lot to do tomorrow. I need to sleep. Lori, you go. Okay, coming. Great. Now it's my turn. I won't be able to sleep tonight. Just my luck. It's always the same. The only monstrous thing here is this cupcake. Well, maybe the monster left it? The monster is only part of your imagination. Let's sleep. Thanks, Lori, for staying with me. You're welcome. Go to sleep. <laughs> Connie, this can't continue like this. You'll spend the night alone. But the monster... Relax. What you need to do is count sheep. And do something that you like a lot. Like cupcakes. And laugh a lot. <sighs> ah! I'll make cupcakes. And if there are a lot of monsters... Connie, a fantasy came. They know how to take the fear away. Seriously? How? With a magical helmet. Wow! A fantasy helmet! Wow! It's not a regular helmet. It's a magical object that puts bravery on whoever wears it. <laughs> hey, Connie, it looks good on you. I see you braver. Yeah, you look like a real fantasy. But it's not real magic, right? No, but look how happy she is. Huh? <laughs> Let's see if I can finally sleep. Otherwise, the pets will do the job. Helmet, the shadows are gone. We have to tell you something, Cotty. The helmet doesn't have powers. You have huh? defeated your fears alone. Oh. Really? By myself? That means that I'm very brave. And when you're brave, the imaginary monsters disappear. Thanks for believing in me. Monsters don't exist. 